Hello and welcome to worship today. Wherever and whenever you are. I'm Susan Cord, Minister of Calernon and Knockbane Parish Churches and I share this service with my husband James Bissett who's Minister of Conton and Strathpeffer Churches. Now a little bit of an update on where we are at Calernon on, on Sunday, so that's the 6th of September. There'll be opportunity for people to gather for worship in Calernon Church Building. Information for those of you who are on email and uh, has been sent out and your elders if you don't have email have, or we don't have your email contact will be in touch with you to let you know. I would encourage you though if you're watching this before quarter past ten on Sunday to maybe think do I need to go because our capacity will only about 20 and I'd hate to think we had to turn anybody away. Not being we're hoping we'll be able to reopen for worship a week on Sunday and we'll do initially alternate weeks. But we'll keep you updated on what's going on. Keep an eye on our socials and Calern and Not Being's Facebook page and on our website and, and on the YouTube channel for updates on that. And now let us pause for a few moments as we still our minds and open our hearts to God's presence with us. Though we gather apart or together, you are with us Lord God through the power of the Holy Spirit, gather us to you and to one another, siblings united as family through time and space to worship and praise you in Christ's name. Amen. Our reading today is from Matthew's Gospel, chapter 18, reading from verses 15 through to 20. If another disciple sins against you, Jesus continued, go and have it out, just between the two of you alone. If they listen to you, you've won back a brother or sister. But if they won't listen to you, you should take with you one or two others so that everything may be established from the mouth of two or three witnesses. If they won't listen to them, tell it to the assembly. And if they won't listen to the assembly, you should treat such a person like you would a Gentile or a tax collector. I'm telling you the truth. Whatever you tie up on earth will have been tied up in heaven. And whatever you untie on earth will have been untied in heaven. Again, let me tell you the truth. If two of you come to an agreement on earth about any matter that you want to ask, it will be done for you by my Father in heaven. Yes, where two or three come together in my name, I'll be there in the midst of them. Amen. And may God add his blessing to this reading from his holy word.